You can get out the chair. There you go. Thank you. All right. <laughs> okay, this is actually going to be crazy because, like, Mark, uh, a new, newly graduating into high-level melee. I know. Welcome, welcome, Mark. Crazy. Using it. Somehow running into the best players on ranks as well. I don't know. How he does it. Yeah, I'm so happy to have Mark back grinding. Sick. Everyone's moving more and more to like the right of the camera, so I might just go over and adjust it. Yeah, go for it. Chive loses to a lot of people better, better than Chive. But I mean, he also sometimes beats people that are better than Chive. So that's why we love Chive. Uh, I'm feeling faint, but that's okay, we will game. I'll play 40 minutes of Samus Beach, it's fine. Whatever. Thanks, Caleb. And shout out to everyone who's tripped in gear this weekend. There's so much equipment. There's yeah. literally so much equipment yeah. here. Honestly, it seems like everything ran great. Like considering no internet, like no interstaters and every like all the. It has run pretty well. It has run. It seems like it went. Everyone seems happy. All right, we're doing it. Oh yeah. Big losers quarters coming up right now. Oh my god. If Mark can take this, I think. Well, this might be the first. Like, if Mark takes this, this might be the first save he's beat Muscat. Like since I've been playing. Honestly, uh, yeah. It's been ages. Like, it would have been at least like four years. I'm surprised Ruben didn't come out with the, the Falcon at all. First must cast speech, but also it doesn't surprise me. Oh. That was such a good way. Must got really good at like the all like the patient recoveries, like just waiting them out and like yeah. Not a lot of folks in the Yeah, like I'll be honest, this is what I like predicted that the set would be. Like we've um Muscat Mark and I have like sat down on setups and it's definitely like not pretty. Like, yeah, like, Mark just kinda of sometimes gets steamrolled. Yeah. Such is life as a Falcon Man. Muscat? Oh wait, yeah. I'm double checking this isn't hand warmers, because he just went from one platform to the other five times. Uh, I definitely told him that I'm ready for him, so this is definitely I'm, the game. Yeah, I'm gonna assume this is a real game, but it's it No, this like, is the game, absolutely. Yeah, 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 I know, but it was just like the funniest sequence of Mark on like a side platform, just like up airs off it, runs to the other side platform, edge cancel up airs off it, runs to the other side platform. God we love Falcon! Such a cool character. Yes! It is funny when he says yes when he on B's and they hit someone and then he dies more. Literally punishable on hit. Yeah, that's it. Insane move. Oh no. This could be the opening Mark needs to win. It's probably not. It's not. GG. See, we take the floaties off the stream, we drop eight viewers. <laughs> it's true though. It's just maths. I have to say, it's so. I don't know, it sounds dumb, but like, winning tournaments is so much easier when you win. I just remember we said that. The, yeah, we the, literally said that. Me and Kath were talking about it, and I was like, yeah, look. The people who are the best at the game are the ones who win more. Yeah, it's because it's, like, you just win and then you're like, wait, I only have to win three games. I don't have to think about like the beating like five good players and losers. Like, oh. I mean, not only that, but it's just like, when you win more, it's like you build up a yeah. Uh, yeah. like a pathway in the brain that's like the, <laughs> winning, win. the winning yeah. pathway. And you're like, okay, I can... F you literally habitualize your brain into getting conditioned into winning more. Yep. But actually, there's um there's a funny phenomena uh -huh. where uh, 
like, if you, so for example, like a track runner, let's say he runs 10, like he runs 100 meters in 10 seconds, right? If you trick the guy in practice that he's actually running like two seconds slow or five seconds, like a second slow, um, that tricks his brain into like working harder and yep. then like will literally surpass the limit that was there before. Yeah, because, that surprised me at least. Yeah, because it's literally just like, oh no, it's a, uh, it's like you build up a... That your, it's your ex expectation to run Yeah, that yeah, fast. yeah. It's, it's literally that, the expectation like, oh. theory. That's sick, actually. Well, you're right, Goody. I am right. afraid of the loser's bracket. I hate going to BAM and then being in the loser's bracket, and then I lose to unseated Spanish player on a controller with <laughs> with insane snapback. I Shout hate the loser's bracket. Shout, Shout out to, to Zardov. To Kath getting 65th in the same player. Losing to Spider and then losing to Zardov one round later. That's insane. <laughs> I still love that story. That's so funny. I was playing him before the tournament. I'm like, this guy's as good as my guy is. And then I like, learned he was sitting last. And I was like, oh, that's so funny. He was not. I don't think he was, was as like, good like, as my I don't think he was as good as Musket. Uh, that was just like an impression, like rough impression. <laughs> I was like, wow, this guy's like really good. He was fucking good though. He was really good at like just hitting you with up smash. Like, he, no, sorry, he was really good at like hitting you with like three hit combos. Yeah. Oh! Speaking of not as good as Muscat, Mark is struggling to take hits. Yeah, he's missing very crucial knees. Uh, and he's missing some very crucial punishes. Yeah. Oh my god, what happened there? Mangs indeed won the Muscat. That's exactly what happened. That's the game you've ever seen. Oh, Mark. He's just flailing with aerials. He can't finish this fox off. Yeah, feel... yeah go ahead. Yeah, I feel like um, Falcon <laughs> suffers Mark Riders sometimes as well. Uh, depends. Like, I feel like a lot of Falcons allow themselves to suffer Mark Riders. Yeah, exactly. They like, go for the stuff that doesn't like, lead to kills. But Falcon has like a lot of... You, you just sort of have to change how you play. I think that's a general rule for like a lot of characters that people don't do lovely. Mm. But they don't change how they play at high percent to actually look for kills. Yeah, yeah. Like watching Mars down tilt 50 times with like 120 just makes me want to try. Oh no, he catches him out of the shield. Muscat just one step ahead. Like, Mark will be in shield, react to Muscat not hitting his shield, and then Muscat will hit him. Oh! Last stock though. Last stock though. Uh, this is what dreams are made of. I feel like Falcon's one crushed. of the hardest characters to make like a high percent comeback up. Just because of how, how like how, like weak moves just like knock him off stage. And Can then you help me move the couch forward a bit? Yep. That's a bit better. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, no, we're really good. Yeah, I don't think so either. He just needs this for a lot. If Bar keeps grinding, I think it's going to become very interesting. The thing is, he's always been a grind lord. It's just, um, his journey is just a, a longer one than some other yeah. people's. Oh my god! That was amazing, actually. Was really Not too good. often you have the confidence to do a full hop backwards yep. just so that you can punish like a short hop near with a knee. Well, it's like Mark's movement's been looking sick. You know, like he said it, he's like, I'm working specifically on like just all my movement stuff. Really good to see. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> the, the edge cancels. Oh, hits the nipple. Oh, good coverage. Mark's yeah, got some sequence. punish. This is some good uh, percent, honestly. Yeah. Uh, like, honestly, like, the difference between... Like, as soon as you hit 50, he needs a kill. And then as soon as you hit 50, down throw becomes a potential kill. And the stomp becomes a potential... Like, everything becomes a potential kill. So, it's like, there's two sequences of Falcon. It's, like, getting them to 40, and then everything that happens after 40. It's, like, the same with a few characters. Well, and then... Uh, jab knocks down, like so much happens after 40. Oh, Cap Court catches a jump. Can he read the up beat? Uh, everyone knows that Musket's up beating that. Like, every fox in the universe is up beating that. Musket bring it back though. Mark just has to finish his food. Like, I don't know. There, there's just like this level. There's oh. just like this sort of. Oh. No, oh. He's alive though. How did he get out of that without getting hit? 
Oh shit! That was booming. I really want Mark to win this stadium game. I really yeah, do. Let's give him one. Musket says no. I back at you. Oh, it's Musket Page. It's not Musket Page. Ah, thank you. Very good. There we go. Foolish. Back to formality. Oh, oh, no. Yeah, I think this. I think like the biggest gap between like roughly Mark's level and Muscat's level is just like hitting the hard edge guards sometimes, like making a read sometimes, and then like actually punishing it. Whereas like you watch Mark. Yeah, yeah. Oh no, he gets to jump back. Oh what? Rip. Now we that have sucks. me. I think. Me yeah, we got winners finals now, and then it'll be losers semis later. Best of luck, friendo. Peach Samus time. Have fun. Oh. You can move the microphone. No, we're good. <laughs> you good? <laughs> McLeod doing the craziest maneuver to get out of commentary box right now. I don't get to tell you how we